Okay, y'all, we're gonna get right into this. I usually don't use jigs, but today it's only like 55 degrees, so I decided to pull out a half ounce black and blue football jig with a little peanut butter and jelly paddle sail swim bait, and I have paired this up with a Fluger Monarch. There you are, Fluger Monarch. Seven foot, medium heavy, and this is in the bait caster. And I have 20 pound braid on here. So let's hope that we can get on something. I don't throw jigs very much just because they're not really my confidence lure. And if you know much about me, I usually throw my confidence lure a lot of times. But today we're trying to trying out new things. So I guess this could be called the jig fishing challenge because I'm not good with a jig. Uh, it's kind of just one of the things that I have fished and fished and just hasn't really done the best for me. So let's hope that we can get on something that's actually pretty good. But yeah, that's, that's the setup we're doing today. I am currently recording on a GoPro Hero 5. Uh-oh. Okay, so again... Just throwing a black and blue jig. Oh, that was a hit. It's only like 55. The water's maybe, let's get down here and see this. Water's maybe 45. So it's not the best, but we can work with it. These fish usually won't catch much, but the fish that are out here are pretty big. But once we get into spring, a little like spawn, the bite usually gets pretty well good. If I have to, I'll change up to something like a jerk bait or something a little more finesse. I mean, a jig is finesse, but I kind of just pulled this out and was like, let's start flipping into cover. Fish are going to be sitting next to logs right now, trying to find heat. And heat is held by like logs and rocks, anything of that nature that will hold heat better than water. They're sitting next to those since they are cold blooded. They try to get the most heat they can this time of year because when water's 45 degrees, they sit by heat trying because they feel the best around that. And they're the most aggressive and they're attracted to heat. So just find the heat and usually all the bait fish are attracted to the heat and if you find the bait fish then usually the predators aren't too far behind them unless you're in some crazy place that is abnormal pretty simple so all I'm doing is when I throw this out here, as you can see, I'm having a bump against things, and you can actually see that the paint's kind of worn off of this jig head, meaning I'm bumping against rocks. So that's a really good way to tell you're rubbing against rocks. You can feel little ticks and bumps around the bottom, and that usually covers cover. If these don't pan out, I'm just tying on a Texas rig and throwing that all day. How about you? Because I feel like a Texas rig is your, you and I's equal confidence bait. I'm hoping next to those tiny bass is going to be like a jumbo. Okay y'all, so switched up tactics a tad. Now I'm throwing a weighted Sanko. We're gonna see if we can snap it. Okay y'all, so back to the challenge. The challenge is a weighted Stanko versus a weightless Stanko. 
Cheese and rice, boys. This is the challenge. We're doing numbers since, yeah, we'll do numbers. Numbers and weight. We'll do. Yeah, the bigger bags. See, how about this? Yeah. Well, unless you change your mind. Looser has to say that other person's a better fisherman. Decently. Okay, you also. That's one. Yes, sir. Yeah, these things are worth that. Yeah, they do. You want to see a perfect rooster? Let's turn the camera. Let's turn the camera. Oh, it's not the best. Hey, that's the beast. Uh-oh. Trying to hook him again. Hey, guys. We're not going to weigh him. He's about the size of him. You want to turn him? Here, turn him this way so you can see his stomach. Here, I see the back. That's a male. Male? Yeah. Are you ready? No. Oh, Rain's starting to pick up, y'all. Now let me fix my Sanko. Oh my gosh, look at these. Alright, looks like this rain is not going to miss us. Um, my bag's probably going to get soaked. What if you open it? can't tell you how many times this giveaway is actually glitched, but you guys won't know about that. Anyways, what I am giving away is, or what we're giving away, is a pack of Guggen Baits. This is the 5 inch Lunker Log in cinnamon. And Tyler ended up using one of these because he got tempted and he wanted to do a challenge with them. Then we have like this spinner bait that has like a red head. And it has an eye and it's got a gold blade. Pretty good spinner bait. Actually, really good spinner bait. I'd use it any day. Then we have a topwater buzz bait, but if you notice anything, it's really tiny. And this would be good for any really small pond fish. I'd suggest going for small fish, but if you happen to hook into a big fish, great for you. Then we have kind of this weird crankbait that I decided to give away. I just it's kind of like a step flip. As you can see I'm not I can't remember exactly the name of these things but anyways we're giving this away it's in the fire tiger pattern as you can see hope you guys can catch fish on these I've caught a couple of fish on these but give them a try then we're giving away it's in the market then we're giving away this bluegill swim bait which if you guys don't know I did a video on this thing and I love these swim baits. I will put that up above on the right corner or one of these corners, I'm not exactly sure which corner, but I will put it above where you can watch that video. But anyways, this is a bluegill swim bait that we will be giving away. And last but not least, this spinner bait right here. So yeah, that's what we're giving away. And this will be shipped to your house. So. Yeah. This is awkward. I just finished to realize just after I finished that, I don't have an outro. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, all you have to do to enter this giveaway is like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And comment down below your favorite spring fishing lure. And we'll choose you. We'll choose you in the next video or next week or however we decide to choose this. But you guys will be entered to the giveaway. Um, I want to keep it to one entry per person. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay safe. God bless. See you in the next video.